And today, Lizzie, Joe, and I are going to be opening up a microscope. That's right, we were sent this to review and unbox and check out for you. So we're going to do it. Are you ready? Yes. All right, let's see what we're going to get. Have you seen it yet? No. Oh, you get a book. Video's um, over. I'm just kidding. <laughs> are these blood cells? Maybe. You get a cleaning cloth. And you're going to get a box of stuff. And you're going to get some other stuff. We're going to go through all this and let you know what all is in here and included. A cord. Hey. And here is the microscope itself. This is like a scientist one. Yeah, I know. It actually has a metal body, which is pretty cool. It's got these interchangeable eyepieces that just pop in and out. But let's see what else we get, and then we'll talk about the details of the microscope more. You do get a power cord because it does have double LEDs. It has one you can turn on for, from the top and look down in case whatever you're looking at can't be seen through. But if you're looking at something really small like blood or water, you can turn the bottom light on and it will shine the light completely through the object from the bottom up to the microscope. You get a box of slides. Lens. And this is what's cool about these slides, Lizzie. Let's see. Oh, they're glass. Oh. So they do give you clean clean glass slides, because, but then they also give you preloaded slides with stuff already on them. Oh. This is a honeybee's leg with pollen on it. Can we see that? How cool is that? I actually never saw a bee's leg up close. I didn't even know that bees have legs. This is human blood. Now that's just creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the guy in the factory giving up all his blood? This is a leaf of a Hydrilla verticillata, whatever that is. I don't know. That's why I didn't make it through science school, because I couldn't <laughs> pronounce the Latin names. What is that? This is um, a Z seed, oh. a small intestine section. Is that from a human? Somebody's guts, I don't know. Okay. It doesn't say. Um. Honeybee wings, a pine young staminate cone. Let's put all these slides back in. Go ahead and open that box and see what's in there. Oh, that's a Petri dish. What's this? Or Remember that's what you put like the gel in and you touch it and it'll grow like bacteria or fungi. Oh! And then you can look at it under the microscope. And this is like where you can like mm -hmm. suck up stuff and then like put it under the microscope. All right, what are these for? This is tweezers. So you can pick up small things. You have a Petri dish. You have a little bulb for one? sucking up fluids so you can put samples onto your slides. You have like a little test tube and a stirring stick for taking samples. And then you have tissues for cleaning your lenses. Or you also get a microfiber cloth for cleaning your lenses as well. And you get whatever this thing is. You know what this is? What? This right here is a really cool attachment. And what it does is it goes over the microscope like this and then you take your phone camera and you line it up with that and you stick it to it and you can take photos of the stuff in the microscope. What? How cool <laughs> is that? But we're going to do that too. But then right here this is your because the magnification on this, it goes from a 40 time magnification all the way up to 2,000 times. What? So you can make something 2,000 times bigger. How cool is that? And that's what all these extra eyepieces are. Because this is a, a 25 times. And the way it works is you have your eyepieces, you have a 25 times, you have a 2 times, and you have a 10 times. And then if you look on the microscope here, you can change the different viewers or the different lenses and these are rated 40 times, 4 times, and 10 times. So if you were to use, you just use simple math, if you take the 10 times and you put it with the 10x, well then you're going to get 100 times and that's how you figure out what magnification. So if you wanted to go the strongest, you would take the 25 times and then you'd go to the strongest one on the microscope, which is a 40 times, and 25 times 40 is what? That's only what, a thousand times. So if you wanted to go to 2,000 times, you would 
take the two times and you would slide it in the tube. Then you take the 25 times and you stack it and now you have 2,000 times. So what we're going to do, I'm going to show you up close a little better view of the microscope itself. So here's the microscope itself. You can see where your eyepieces go. These are your different magnifiers that you can switch through. On here you have a 10 times, a 4 times, and a 40 times. It's got the little slide holders. You have a top view LED right here and your bottom view LED is down here for lighting up from the bottom. You have your focus knob on the side right here. The big knob is your fast focus and then the small knob is for fine tuning. And then on the back you can see where you can plug in your power source and then you have your top LED and your bottom LED. And then on the bottom, if you don't want to plug it in, you can put three AA batteries in. How cool is that? If you don't want a cord, just stick some batteries in the bottom. So all we need to do now is, we're gonna go ahead. Are you ready to play with this, Lizzie? I didn't point this out, but on the side, this is a dimmer switch right here. So you can brighten up your lights or lower your lights. So how cool is that, right? Let's put this on. You wanna go ahead, and, which slide are you gonna put in? Oh, the small intestine slide. I want to see what it looks like. Okay. I'm a little scientist. Go ahead. Look in there. What? <laughs> What's that look like? Creepy. Looks like space. And you ready for a new slide? Yep. All right, we're going to raise it up. Pull the slide out. Which one do you want to look at next? Hmm. This invisible thing. What is that? And when you put it on there, I just put my eye up there. All right, Lizzie, check it out. Whoa! What does that look like? I don't really know. A bunch of turtles. All right, which one now, Lizzie Joe? Human blood. Okay, we're gonna look at some blood. Because we're vampires, rawr. Blood, blood, blood. Do you know what they look like? No. Probably just like um little circles. Let's see. <gasps> <laughs> can you can look like little red donuts? <laughs> so as you can see, it's a very nice set. It's very complete. You get. The, all the eyepieces you need to go from 40 times all the way up to 2,000 times magnification. They give you a bunch of really cool preloaded slides. And they also give you some blank ones that you can look at to look at your own stuff from around your house, right? Yeah. They give you everything you need to clean it. They give you a full instruction booklet. They give you all your little science gears. They even give you the phone adapter for the binocular piece right there. But overall, a very nice complete set. Lizzie, what do you think? It's really Cool. You like it? Are you going to keep it? Yeah. Or should I give it away? No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. So, we hope this video helps, and thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>